Electrical Insulation Rubber Product Introduction by GSE Online Sendirian Burhad We are having the most complete range of electrical insulation rubber mats are also known as electrical switchboard rubber matting under BSEN or IEC 61111 year 2009 Electrical Insulating Matting British or European Union Standards in Malaysia our offered range consists of class 0 to 4 or class resistant from 1000 volts to 36000 volts. IEC 61111 is the latest standard for electrical insulating matting and made of elastomer for use as a floor covering or matting for the electrical protection of workers to prevent electric shock and hazards around electrical equipment, from low voltage model GSLV, medium voltage GSSL or GSMV, and high voltage SMG, MHV, HV or SLG. It is very important for users to select the right insulating mats for specific applications depend on the worker exposure to operating voltage and matting is tested to withstand certain specified voltages. Our electrical insulation matting are tested according to IEC withstand voltage by third-party certified accredited laboratory in Malaysia. IEC 61111 Year 2009 Clause 5.6.4.3 for dry AC power frequency voltage withstand. Electrical safety matting is tested to maximum withstand voltage than the recommended nominal maximum use voltage. The voltage at which the matting is certified to is the safe working voltage under IEC standard. Our description of withstand voltage test for each of our products The test samples were subjected to dielectric withstand test for minimum of 3 minutes or 180 seconds. The voltage is applied to each test sample at a constant rate of rise of 1 kV per second until the withstand voltage value of specified voltage is reached. The requirement is no electrical puncture shall occur. All tests were performed in an insulating liquid. Our electrical insulation rubber mats are full compliance to restriction use of hazardous substances, named ROS 1 and 2 with SGS certificates of compliance test reports. On 4 June 2015, Commission Directive EU 2015-863 was published in the official journal of the European Union OJEU, to include the phthalate BBP, DBP, DEHP and DIBP into Annex 2 of the ROSE Recast Directive. The new law restricts each phthalate to no more than 0.1% or less than 1000 ppm in each homogeneous material of an electrical product. The restriction of DEHP, BBP, DBP and DIBP will apply from the 22nd of July 2019 onwards depending on product category. A measure that reduce the content of harmful substances in materials and products. The inclusion of the phthalate for the remaining product categories will come into force by the 22nd of July 2021 and compliance product has a CE mark. The 10 substances restricted under ROS 1 and 2 are namely, 1, lead, 2, mercury, 3, cadmium, 4, hexavalent chromium, 5, polybrominated biphenyls, PBB, 6, polybrominated diphenyl ethers, PBDE, 7, BIS, 2, ethylhexyl, phthalate, DEHP, 8, butyl benzyl phthalate, BBP, 9, dibutyl phthalate, DBP, 10, diisobutyl phthalate, DIBP. Our note to users, users need to evaluate suitability for their applications before placing order from us. The information provided best advise our customers correspond to current electrical matting standards. In the individual case it is the sole responsibility of the users to evaluate requirements, in particular if specified properties are sufficient for use. All information provided rights reserved by GSE Online Sendirian Burhad.